Coming to you live from Stewart, Florida, the greatest little town in the world. It's the Get Up and Go Show on AM 1450 WSTU. You're invited to call the show anytime at 772-220-9788. And now, broadcasting live from their palatial studios, here are your hosts, Evan and Bonnie. Eight oh seven on the Get Up and Go Show with Evan and Bonnie, giving you a little holiday music. This is Mannheim Steamroller, one of Bonnie's favorites. This is Do You Hear What I Hear? Do you hear what I hear, Bonnie? I'm hearing something really good. Yes. So am I. <laughs> They're just so good, Mannheim Steamroller. Yeah. Just kind of gets you in that holiday spirit. Yeah, you never tire of them. You could listen to Mannheim for like hours yeah. for Christmas. Exactly. Yeah. Another uh, item that we can listen to for hours probably is the uh, the topic of health insurance. And uh, joining us in studio right now is Gary Owen. He heads up the Owen Insurance Group just down the street on the other side of the Roosevelt Bridge. They have a show here on uh, WSTU. Yeah. And WPSL on Tuesdays yeah. at 10 a.m. So it's called The Quality of Life. Monday, the show is right here, and you get to be with Mr. Owen no, Tuesday. every Monday. Tuesday, Tuesday is when you Tuesdays. get to be with Mr. Owen Tuesdays. right here. Tuesdays. Tuesdays, I'm with Gary Owen. He's joining us on our in our studio right now. Gary, good morning. Good morning. Hey. I love the uh, Mannheim steamroller. Isn't that quite great frankly, stuff? I've never heard of them before. So really? There goes shows my ignorance. Wow. That's all right. That's oh. all right. I'm too busy in the health insurance and Medicare and life insurance industry. I've got to, you know, kind of get outside every once in a while, I think. So um tell tell me, how did you get in how did you get started in the uh, the health insurance aspect of the business? Before we do that, uh, okay. all our listeners this morning, I want to personally say Happy holidays! Yes. Merry Christmas! Yes. Happy Hanukkah! Uh, and Happy Hanukkah! And uh, my, Kwanzaa. my Kwanzaa. girlfriend says I got to get more in the holiday spirit. I'm uh, not uh, not feeling it this year, but uh, we're excited for the new year to come. 2021 yeah. is going to be a great year for all of us. So I'm excited for that. It really, is. I'm excited for our town, for our country, and uh, for all of you that are listening this morning. Why am I excited? Because we have got some really good information to share. And you know, we were listening, do you hear what I hear? Well, how about, do you hear what I'm about to tell you? <laughs> I, I think that, that has a That's good, a great that has a good vibe. <laughs> That's a great segue. That's an excellent, excellent segue. So you, you've been in the insurance business how many years now? 15 years. 15 years. Got it. A friend of mine got me involved with it. And, okay. And uh, I started working with a career uh, insurance carrier. So uh, mm-hmm. being captive in, in a career carrier means that you can only – represent that one company okay so if there were other insurance products that were better uh, it's too bad you've got to sell what you've got and um, that 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 didn't appeal to me very well so I then decided to become a independent broker okay and that is where uh, that's the most important that, that changed my life quite okay. frankly and the trajectory of my business okay so for those of you that are listening out there uh, if you have an insurance broker you're looking for an insurance broker well here I am. This but, is the guy to call. But, but before, but more importantly, uh, find someone. You, you've got to ask a lot of questions right. before you even make a decision on who you're going to work with. Right. How long they've been in business? What's their education? What do they specialize in? Uh, do they, have they, did they graduate the American College? One thing I'm very proud of is I graduated the American College. Uh, I earned a Life Underwriting Training Council Fellow designation. Less than 10% of insurance agents out there even have that. So uh, that's important. Why is that important? Because it, it that type of uh, education and experience uh, works for you. So that's very, very important. I'm also Medicare certified. So we'll we'll talk a little bit about Medicare and the difference because I know there's a lot of mm-hmm. questions out there. Mm-hmm. Quite frankly, Evan and Bonnie, that people don't know the difference between Medicare, ACA, healthcare, yeah. under 65 insurance plans, over 65, and all, and Medicaid. Mm-hmm. There's so much stuff. And you can help people. You can help people in all those different areas. Um, if somebody needs insurance, you're the guy they can call because the best part about calling you is there's no charge to call you. What? There's no charge to come in and see you. It's free. Now, are you the gentleman that we call to find out the best rates of when we're looking for insurance so, and you can possibly get us that? So I'm glad you asked that, Bonnie, because 
uh, it's not really about the best rates, right? It's about the best carrier who has the best rate stability, who has the best financial uh, rating, right. uh, claims paying ability. There are so many things that you mm-hmm. have to uncover before you make an educated decision. Yeah, because you don't want cheap insurance. You get what you, you don't pay want, for, baby. You don't want a C-rated or a D-rated company. You want an A-rated company. A-rated or better. That, that's yes. Exactly. That's going to make sure that when that bill drops, they're going to pay the claim for you and you're not stuck paying the bill. A hundred percent. hundred percent. And you handle and work with gosh knows how many different companies that are out there. Hundreds. And there's there's wow. a new one that has just come around that I've heard you talk about on your program, and it's called Oscar. Yes. They're brand new to the area. Martin in St. Lucie County, mm-hmm. Indian River County. Also, uh, Cigna. So Cigna, Cigna and Oscar Health both are giving Florida Blue a run okay. for their money. And so, it's about time somebody gave them time. a run for their money. It's about time. They well, own, they cornered the market on health care here in the Treasury. Definitely Coast. so. Now, what's what's very cool is back in the Obama administration – that's when they started the Obamacare and the marketplace, and that's where people were able to get health insurance at a reasonable reduced rate depending on their income. Right. It's called sub, uh, it's subsidized yes. by how much money that you make and how many people are in your household. Excellent. But what's very cool about this now do you is have that- a, Do you have an insurance license? No, I don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> you, but <laughs> rushed up. No, I, I, I've done my homework. <laughs> but what's very cool about this- and it's very confusing to go on the marketplace and sign up for this. It really, Bonnie, it, it it's mm-hmm. very, very confusing unless you know what you're doing. And this is where taking the confusion out of it right. comes in with you because you can take that headache away from the customer and you can walk them through the process and do all the work for them. Yeah, case in point, uh, we were working, well, actually, Julie in my office. Mm-hmm. Uh, we've got Julie in the office who uh, does a lot of quotes for the mm-hmm. ACA health mm-hmm. insurance under mm-hmm. 65 market. And we had a couple of clients, and one specifically uh, you know, called us. I, I suggested she called Julie to help her out with her ACA. Mm-hmm. Uh, and um, she spent a lot of time with this individual. Mm-hmm. And the individual thought they'd, they'd go on the uh, Marketplace website and do it themselves. Mm-hmm. For whatever reason, I have no idea. Right. And got into trouble and then calls us back and wants us to fix her mess. Wow. wow. Don't do oh. that. Please don't do that. Don't yeah. be ignorant, man. <laughs> right. If someone's working with you, I don't care who it is, if right. someone's working with you, spending, investing the time and the energy mm-hmm. on your behalf, and then you go and, and try to do it somewhere else, I, I, don't, I don't understand that. Uh, and it wasn't going to cost her any more uh, to work with us because mm-hmm. we don't charge, as you so eloquently stated. That's right. We do not repeat do not charge for our services that's the good to know so, <laughs> it is there's no yeah. fee when you walk in the door of the owen insurance group you're not going to pay a fee you're not going to pay one single penny the only money you're going to pay is if you sign up and you'll pay for your premium that's right and the premium is not going to be elevated so they make money as a um whatever it is it's they make they the way they get paid is from the carrier themselves by signing somebody up. It's the same rate you're going to pay as if you do it yourself, but they're going to act as your advocate. Correct. Yeah, we are their guide. So uh, we'll we'll find out we have a holistic approach on our healthcare, life insurance, Medicare planning. Ask a lot of questions to find out where you are, where you want to be, and then we can make some appropriate decisions on your behalf. And what's really confounding to me, really, I mean, I mm-hmm. it, it just it boggles the mind. And, okay. and listen, there's many of you that are out there listening this morning, maybe guilty of this. And if you are, it's time to do a 180 because you know we buy cars, nice cars, and right. we insure those cars. Mm-hmm. We buy homes. We insure those homes. Right. Why don't you insure your health? Insure your quality of life. I mean, what price tag do you put on your on your life? So it's important and incumbent upon you uh, to protect your quality of life, your quality of health, and that's what we do. I mean, we spend thousands of dollars on homeowners insurance, mm-hmm. automobile insurance, but we cheapen our life. Come on. Now, what if somebody wants life insurance? Do you handle that also through your office? That is my expertise. Wow. Medicare and life insurance. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. Very good. Now, I, I've had my life insurance policies for quite some time. I have um, two policies that that I have. 
uh, and I'm very transparent with my life. My listeners know that. So I'm, you know, when my time is up, my wife is going to be very well taken care of. Mortgage is going to get paid off, and she'll have a nice chunk of change Perfect. to make sure of things. That's the way to do it, buddy. Um, I, I've got, uh, mm. I, I forget who I have my policies through, but they're A-rated companies. That's all that I know because I wanted to make sure that I, you know, I, I got a good company, so I made sure that they were A-rated. Now, had I known that you dealt with this, Prior, I would have, of course, went through your company. How'd you do it for me? Well, listen, it's always but, good to have a review if you've had it for a couple years. It's good yeah. to have a review to see mm-hmm. uh, how it's performing if you have the right policy. Right. Because uh, the mortality tables and the CSO tables change mm-hmm. and the premiums can get lowered. So right. it, it's good to have a second set of eyes on something and right. see if it makes sense to still right. keep it. That's, that's the way to do it. A lot of our listeners um, don't know the difference between health insurance, and Medicare, and a lot of people get it confused with Medicaid also. Mm -hmm. So if you could maybe explain the difference to our listeners, what the difference is between Medicare and regular health insurance. Good, Good point, because we see that ourselves, quite frankly. Right. So if you are turning 65, give Gary Owen a call. Because uh, six months out, you can start preparing for your Medicare planning. You can't really enroll in Medicare uh, unless it's about 100 days prior to you turning 65. And and many people don't even know where to go to enroll. I mean, people are clueless what to do. So we will help guide you on what to do. These are the steps to take. So uh, when you're turning 65, you are leaving your health insurance. In fact, you're not allowed to be on an ACA health plan okay. if you're turning 65. You just All can't right. do it. So, I didn't even know that. Yeah, you see? It's against the law. So, wow. Uh, you've got you to... have a ways to go, Bonnie. <laughs> <laughs> I, no, I've not... only got... Bonnie, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> yeah, not too far to go. I, I've only got three and a half more years, and I'll be switching over to Medicare. I can't believe I'm saying that. TikTok, Jeez. TikTok. I know, right? <laughs> so uh, so turning 65 uh, or beyond, I mean, listen, people we know are working longer. Right. They have to work longer. So if you're, say, 68, 69, 70... Mm-hmm. Heck, there's a guy who called me who's 85 years old. Oh, my. And he's, he's... Re- finally retiring. Oh, yeah. Never wow. been in Medicare yet. So uh, we're going to guide him. He's coming to our office next month, and we're going to help him get enrolled in Medicare Part B. Uh, Wait a minute. You... So I'm going to stop you there. Part B. Yes. Okay. Tell what, what does that mean? Is there a Part A and a Part B? There's a Part D. There's a Part <laughs> C. Yes, Part A. Part okay. A is for a hospital. So uh, okay. that's the very first thing. If you've worked... Ten years uh, in the in, in the in the workforce, you get Part A for free. That's worth about four hundred and fifty dollars a month having Part A for free. So that's premium free. Really, if you ten years. Yes. So when I turn sixty five, I can get Medicare Part A for free, totally free, totally free. So Something if I to look it's, forward to. so if I go to the hospital. God forbid I go to the hospital. Does that include the emergency room? Emergency room. But if you're in the hospital, though, remember with just original Medicare, A and B. A and B. B is for medical. Okay. A is for hospital. Okay. So you have A and B. And, and there were uh, Kathy in our office uh, went to a client in Port St. Lucie yesterday. Okay. And they were only on, Bonnie, original Medicare. A and B only. Oh. That is a nightmare because if you go to the hospital with only original Medicare, you the, the deductible is $1,485. Okay. Let's say three months later, you go back to the hospital again, mm-hmm. guess what you're paying for the deductible? $1,485. $1,485. So it's per occurrence, and, not per year. Per benefit period, which is every 60 days. So oh, okay. if you go back to the hospital 59 days, uh-huh. guess what? You don't have to pay that deductible again. Okay. But you will have to pay the Part B, which is the medical, the 20% for the medical. Okay. okay. So you're paying that fourteen hundred and eighty five is coming out of your pocket. Out of your pocket if you don't right. have a supplement plan or a Medicare Advantage plan to, to, to bridge those gaps to yeah. original Medicare. Does any of that include ambulance on the way it does, there? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Yep. So it's important that and and quite frankly, the statistics are alarming. There's roughly twelve to thirteen percent of Medicare beneficiaries in the country today that only have original Medicare because they think that's all they need. And then when they get uh-huh. sick and where they have to go to the hospital, that's when reality really sits sets in. So what is original Medicare and then Medicare Part A and Part B? Part C, A and D B and e. is original Medicare. Okay, so, so that's no A and B. Medicare. Okay, yep. so A and B is original Medicare. Yep. So so when I turn sixty five 
I, I get Part A automatically. I sign up for it, no charge. And if I get put in the hospital, it's it's covered under Medicare Part, Part A. A. You got okay. it. Okay, Medicare Part B is the medical side of things. That's right. Which covers what? I think I'm going to hire you as an agent. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you, I just I you dissect got it down. I hat, di- I dissect. I like to dissect things. <laughs> Well, listen, we'll, uh, we'll schedule a one-on-one consult just to okay. see how well you perform. Okay. All right. But anyway, yeah. So Evan's part... got a new career coming up. <laughs> Why not? Hey, listen, he's retiring. I mean, you know how many people retire? Why not? And get in the insurance industry yeah. and, and earn, a, you know, earn some nice income. I so. know. Mm-hmm. And help people because, listen, they can help their contemporaries because yeah. they're on Medicare now. Yeah. And they can help their contemporaries make a great choice. Mm-hmm. So, so what is Part B? Tell me what Part B covers. Part B covers the medical side. So if you need to go to a doctor or you need to have a procedure or uh, okay. have a surgery, you'll pay. The, there's a Part B deductible. Okay. Uh, it's only for 2021 is $205 a year. That's it. That's, That's it. All you've got to pay for the Part B deductible. And then after really? that, you pay Medicare pays 80%, and then the consumer or the Medicare beneficiary will pay 20%. So think about it. if you have a a oh. hundred thousand dollar medical bill, okay, that can cost you a lot of money out of yeah. pocket. So okay. that's why it's important. We always always recommend people who only have a Medicare A and B to bridge it with a supplement plan, a Medicare supplement plan, okay. mm-hmm. or a Medicare Advantage plan, depending on your current situation. That's why you always see all those healthcare commercials on TV telling you to supplement and combine a couple yes. of them. Uh, I'm sure mo- uh, if you're like me, uh, you're probably tired of the. Thank God the political commercials are gone. But now you know they, who I'm tired of Medicare. Looking at oh on TV. my God! I sent you a screenshot. Oh of that. my Lord! Listen, yeah, everyone's I'm tired, of looking, tired of him. I'm tired of looking at him. Everyone's. Tired he was of good him. back in the day when when he <laughs> when he played, but you know, he, not he's no a, more. he's not a pro anymore. Because no. uh, he's giving misinformation, unfortunately, right. to consumers. But right. listen, he, that again, uh, when you see those commercials out there mm-hmm. uh, trying to entice you to call them and to enroll in their plan, when you get when they get you on the phone, look out because they're going to put their claws in you mm-hmm. and they're going to pressure you to enroll in their plan. Mm-hmm. But there's not. Remember this: if you take nothing out of what I say here today, okay. I want you to hear this. Okay, are you listening? Go ahead. There is not a one plan fits all solution, whether it's Medicare, whether it's life insurance, or whether it's health care. There is not a one plan fits all solution. So if your plan, if your sister, your brother, your family member, your neighbor has brand X and you ask them, what did you enroll in? And you go and enroll in the same plan. You're probably setting yourself up for major heartbreak. Wow. Yeah. That's amazing. That's him. Um, one of the most important things that we didn't even touch on is how do people get a hold of you? Because that's the most important thing. Smoke um, signals, the Batman uh, yeah. signal, um, phone number, email, website. It's easy. 772-210-1020. That's 772-210-1020. And we just moved, Evan, to a 3,000-square-foot uh, facility. Palatial. So, so growing. Palatial facilities. Beautiful. Yes. When you step in, you think you're in Scotland. Oh, wow. And that's where you said you got your hat from. I got my that's hat gonna... from Scotland. That's where his background got is my, I got oh. a I got a barrel yeah. in Scotland. That's um, a cool hat, by the way. Thank yeah. you very it's much. It's a nice derby. Just look for the guy in the fabulous hat. <laughs> <laughs> and fabulous blue jeans. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yes, definitely. Bar- Bonnie's blushing over there. I love it. She does. She doesn't take much to get her to blush. Trust me. There's some pretty nice jeans. Yes, fabulous. Uh, I'll Don't walk worry. out. I'll walk out backwards. There you go. But, but where are your? Um, where is your facility located? Do you know where the Key West Diner is? I absolutely do. Right there. Yeah. Right behind the you Key could West go Diner. Have, you could go have lunch. Okay. And then go take care of your business, uh, or do your yeah. business, and then have lunch, or even do your business before you come to up my yeah, office. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, or actually, you know, if if you walk in and you're really satisfied with their service, you could say, "Hey, let's go get a bite to eat," and you go get a bite to eat right at the Key West Diner. That or, sounds like a done deal. Or yeah. hey, if you're a Scotch drinker, uh, mm-hmm. we're a bourbon drinker. We may even yeah. have a special dram for you waiting with your name on it. Who there knows? You, go. you know, just, just never know what kind of surprises you're going to have at Owen Insurance Group. Definitely. Divine. So. And uh, one thing that separates us apart from our competition is not only my education, my experience, the length of time doing this, my passion, my 34 years on the Treasure Coast, 
but we're also a uh, FMO. It's, it's, it's known as a field marketing organization or an IMO, an independent marketing organization, which means that uh, we have over 400 agents that uh, work with us throughout the state of Florida, Georgia, Virginia, Texas, California. So we're just not, I mean, yes, we are your local insurance yeah. agency, okay. but for agents that are outside uh, our local area, we support them as well. Can you compare it to like, um, this might be a weird synopsis, but like, can you compare it to like when I went to looking for new vehicles, instead of going to the small dealership, I went to the big dealership with a number of vehicles I could choose from. Mm -hmm. So when I go through you, knowing that you know all of these number of people and you're affiliated with all of these other agents, am I kind of comparison I, I love, that I, a little I love bit, that analogy right? I mean one thing that you won't get with us with any of my team members you're not going to get the high pressured sales BS you know uh, pressuring you to make a decision ah. to enroll in this plan or, or do that every one of my sales team is professional they're educated they're trained uh, and if they mess up they get the 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 roar of Gary's lion. Mm -hmm. So they, they know to not mess up. And he actually talked about somebody on his show a week or so ago that somebody that came into his office that had TRICARE. And TRICARE is is probably one of the top dogs um, because TRICARE is, is is a lot of military folk have that. That's right. Um, I know that because my dad had TRICARE. And somebody came into his office and they had TRICARE. And Gary's first words were, I'm not even going to touch that with a 10-foot no pole. No way. Just stay where you are. Nope. Have a nice day. Yep. That short, sweet, simple, right to the point. And he appreciated Done. that yeah. because you know he was being contacted by various uh, call centers and agents to, to get him to uh, enroll in one of their plans. And I'm like, listen, the TRICARE for Life is something that you have for life, and you do not want to screw that up by enrolling in a, an Advantage plan or something yeah. like that. So it would really mess you up, and do not. Do not let anybody talk you out of your TFL, your TRICARE for Life plan. And, and, and same thing with VA. I mean, there are a lot of veterans out there right. who uh, they go to the VA, and for people like that, and they, most of those people get their prescription drugs from the VA. Mm -hmm. So there are plans out there that, and, and, a lot, and it's, it breaks my heart to see this, there are a lot of veterans who are only living on their Social Security. So they've got limited income, limited resources, but there are plans out there, folks, for those vets that you can enroll in a Medicare plan that will give you a, a partial or a full give back of your Part B premium. So for those of you who are veterans on VA, not TRICARE for life, uh, but if, if, you're, if you're a vet and uh, you don't have the right Medicare plan, reach out to our office. I mean, Medicare open enrollment is quickly uh, uh, ends here on December 7th. It's quickly mm -hmm. approaching. You've only have a couple of days left. And Evan, I'm going to tell you, we are slam jammed. That's good. Slam jammed. And that's a good but thing. But when you do the right thing, it pays, pays back in great dividends. Yeah, definitely. Good so karma follows. Give the, uh, give the numbers out uh, once again, if you would. And, and Absolutely. also your address where you're located and website. So people know how to reach you and your fine staff. Hurry up and Scuttle to the paper and pen. Yep. And it's 772-210-1020. That's 772-210-1020. Our address is 1611 Northwest Federal Highway North. You've got to put that N at the end of that address. Otherwise, it's gonna your GPS will take you to another location at the foot of the Roosevelt Bridge. So it's 1611 Northwest Roosevelt. Um, yeah, 1611 <laughs> Northwest Federal Highway North Stewart. And our website is very easy. Owen insurancegroup.net you can also find me at medicare for those of you who are on medicare or need some medicare help medicarejourney.com i'm glad you've been with us because actually yeah. for the last week or so my better half has been asking for your number and that gary owen on your radio station fantastic well, there you yeah. go there you go you can go <laughs> yeah. and, see and, him. and bonnie and evan i appreciate the opportunity being with you this oh, morning in, in your audience and we're it's here to help pleasure. you um, I've been here for, as I said, 34 years, so we want to do the right thing 100% of the time. I appreciate it. Our very special guest is Gary Owen from the Owen Insurance Group. We're going to take a short pause, and when we come back, Randy Siegel is going to be here with the Space Report. With the